With just a few nights before election night, it's time for the Purple Power to step up. Purple Power is the name that I gave and created for the followers of this community. After we weren't seeing stimulus land on our hands, there was a need to step up and be very vocal. And now, just a few nights away, it's time to be louder than ever. And despite whatever happens on election night, we're not stopping our efforts there. Oh, no. We all know that ultimately the push for, for second stimulus and third stimulus will continue after election night. And that whatever happens on election night, if it's not our president that we wish, our candidate that we wish to win doesn't win, or it's not our senator that we had hoped wins, uh, we will continue our push because... We're going to get second stimulus. We're going to get third stimulus. It's just a question of how much. And that's the reason of the push of the Purple Power. But tonight I also have a special message. As we enter the holiday seasons, as of tonight, because of the start of Halloween, Thanksgiving just around the corner, it's important that this community, this family of wonderful people, supports one another emotionally and in spirit throughout this holiday season. And so I invite you to join me on tonight's recording of Purple Power. Hey, good evening, everybody. I'm here, you're here, and uh, is anyone dressed up as Nancy for Halloween? I hope not. I mean, that's scary enough. <laughs> I mean, you know, Nancy and Mitch walked into Halloween party. <laughs> fill, fill, finish the joke. I uh, hope you're good and safe. This is Purple Power. I'm so glad that you joined me. Purple Power describes the followers of this channel, of this channel, a name that I came up with after I was wearing a lot of purple and people calling me Mr. Purple. So I referred to the followers of purple of this channel as Purple Power. But it also refers to the push, push, push of the community to get their stimulus. If you're not part of the community and want to go to the front of this channel, subscribe. It doesn't cost you anything. You just subscribe to this channel. Subscribe to this channel so you can alert when a new video goes live. Become part of this community. Community, meet people, interact, live chat, instant premiere, chat on social media. It's an incredible family. People are starting to meet each other and interact and share a commonality, which is stimulus. Also, like this video. <clears throat> In this video, I'll be going over really what I want you to stay laser focused on with these last few days and what goes on as of Wednesday. It's a little bit of a educational path, but it's also a little bit of a, an emotional path. So what I want you to focus on is the following. Let's get to the breaking news. The breaking news is that with two days before election night, the election races are too close to call, and you can still change them, Purple Power. You can absolutely still change them. The original hashtag, I think, that I started Purple Power with was LLA Write the Bill, and I think Seats for Stimulus was about the same day. Hashtag Seats, the number four stimulus altogether, was to describe voting out all incumbents who did not give you stimulus. And at the time that I started it, I said, okay, um, it's contingent on that they don't, that they just don't give us a bill, uh, don't give us a law, and if they write a bill, then we're still going to vote them out. Well, they made it easier because they didn't even write the bill. They didn't write the bill, they didn't vote on the bill, they didn't give us a law, they, just, they did nothing. So the Seats for Stimulus, get those hashtags going on social media. Encourage people to vote out all incumbents because they did not give you stimulus. That refers to both the president and the members of Congress, if you believe that they were responsible for giving you stimulus and did not, then vote them out. Next, MSC, hashtag MSC. That was the, the push that I started about two weeks ago and refers to the need to give you multiple stimulus checks during the second stimulus package period. That's the period from May to the present. You were owed multiple stimulus checks because you suffered multiple months of this pandemic and that's pre-lockdown. That's May to now. Senator Harris, who's the VP nominee, wrote the bill for $2,000 a month for six months or until the pandemic improves or unemployment goes down. That's 12000 well, no, we're at seven months now, aren't we? So it's it's a couple dollars. Then 
The next push I started a week ago was Purple Power Caucus. It's to start the discourse, to start the push to discuss how much stimulus you need, and that was before we had the threat of lockdowns. And now those caucuses are even more than important than ever. On Twitter, on Facebook, on Instagram, start the hashtags. Hashtag Purple Power Check all together, and then hashtag Purple Power FPUC and hashtag purple power hazard pay. If you believe you're entitled to multiple stimulus checks, tweet those, tweet your message, see if people agree with them, retweet, share your tweets, become part of the community, part, be part of the discourse. As the discourse increases and you sort of find a commonality, a common ground of how much you think certain things should be, then you need to really push, push, push with your elected officials and you need to push with the people who get a, who win on election night. So for example, if someone wins and they're coming in in January and they're not in a contested race, there's no runoff, then you should be on their Twitter handle if they, if they are in your district and say, hey, congratulations on your win. This is what I think. Uh, they're going to want to pass bills. They're newbies. They want to do stuff and they're going to want to hear your input. So get that message out loud and clear. Now let's turn to another subject. And the subject is Tuesday night or Wednesday morning. You're going to see election results and two things can happen. And I want to prepare you emotionally and financially for both of them. One, you may see your candidate lose and may think, oh God, so I'm not gonna get stimulus because X to Y to Z and E becomes F. You see why I said it that way. I don't want you to do that because if I can't predict it, how can you predict it? I just, not to say that I'm any better than you, but uh, I, I fully predict, <laughs> I predict that someone's gonna predict something and their prediction's gonna be wrong. <laughs> Let's just say it that way. Uh, I don't want you to do that. If your candidate loses on Tuesday night, don't presume you're not gonna see something. And I think there's going to be a rush to one information and a rush to see um, predictions, clairvoyance, you know, um, uh, projections, and they're just going to be eating you up alive with fake narratives. So I don't want you to do that. Um, that's the first thing. The second thing is I don't want you to think that based upon election results that anything stops your path for stimulus. It just doesn't. It's just, you know, there's nothing in the any of the scenarios that stops your path for stimulus. So I don't want you to think that. Um, net, third, it's important that you keep the community that you associate with on social media and on the channel tight because there's going to be ultimately some people who are really not part of the Purple Power community that want to jump in and just make everyone depressed. <laughs> Someone's going to jump in on Wednesday morning and say, we're not going to get anything ever, ever. <laughs> you know there's that person. Ever. I mean, it's like e, it's E E V E R R R R R R R R. Period. It's just, you know, there's going to be that person. I want you to sort of, you know, brush that person away, just sort of ignore that person. Um, or someone's going to jump in and become very partisan. You remember, purple power is not partisan. We're, we're, we're red and blue, becomes purple. Um, who I vote for president means nothing about who you vote for president. Ultimately, it's who gives you the stimulus. Um, this is not a political channel. This is a, the channel to give you economic stability and financial stability going forward. Finally, the last thing, a personal message. A personal message, which is... Tonight's Halloween, and by all accounts, Halloween is usually what is perceived as, perceived as the start of the holiday season. If you went into Home Depot this week, you will see the Christmas decorations up. If you look at the calendar, Thanksgiving just around the corner. If you see the decorations or things around you, you will see holiday coming upon us. With holiday comes depression for some people. With holiday comes financial uh, strain for some people. It is a pairing of yin and yang that uh, holidays are supposed to be times of this as we've portrayed them in the American uh, landscape of greeting cards and everything. And that sometimes that 
image is not what our life is. And what's important to understand is that this is a community where everyone helps another. So I never want you to feel alone. I never want you to feel depressed. And I never want you to feel empty. That ultimately, if you see someone on the channel who's sending red, uh, purple hearts, who's sending purple um uh, notes. Some, uh, there's these uh, musical notes that are purple that are beautiful. People are putting as emojis. I don't know where they're getting them from. Uh, or other purple emojis. I want you to interact with that person. And if you feel you need someone to talk to, talk with other people in this channel. Do not feel alone. Do not feel empty. And do not feel um, that your life is different than anyone else's. Everyone's going through struggle. On early mornings, LLA, every day at 6 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, 3 a.m. Pacific Standard Time, is the first of two shows. There's one at 6 o'clock and there's one at 6.30. Both are instant premieres with a live chat on the right, which allows you to gump, watch the show as it, it premieres and then chat with other people in the Purple Power community. That little bit of, of chatting with other people really is a great feeling because the feeling makes you feel at home makes you feel that you recognize names you recognize you recognize messages and you have a commonality and that might make the difference for you in waking up every morning that ultimately if you wake up in the morning you say i don't know if i can do this for christmas i don't know if i can do this for thanksgiving but if you wake up and you see those people in there having a giggle to my bad joke about someone's hair or a uh, bad joke about uh, someone's lobster, then ultimately that might make the difference for you. It may pick your spirits up and it might say, hey, you know what? I have other people around me that I see in this chat who are dealing with problems also. And we're going to deal with it together and together we'll get through it. And I hope that and any other type of element that this channel brings helps progress you further. Today of all things, um, in the middle of the day, I did a video on the blue moon. Uh, you know, uh, LA Light, the channel, the, the website does uh, super moon, full moon, um, eclipse stories all the time. It is, it's very, very popular stories. And so this was an easy one. It was, okay, maybe we'll just do one for the channel. And needless to say, it was ranking number one in the United States on Google today, the video. Uh, which is just incredible. But we did it as instant premiere, and people loved just talking about the moon. <laughs> I, it was just an instant, it was an instant premiere of live chat. People just love chatting with the moon. So things like that make the difference, and that's how we get through things together. If you've not, go to the Funnels channel, subscribe, and you're going to get through this together with me as well. And also like this video. Coming up tomorrow morning at 6 a.m. is Early Mornings LA. As always, stay informed, stay smiling, and stay up LA.